So another weekend, which is amazing. Um, this is Friday evening and it was a really, really tough week. I did a lot of things and this was epic and I did a lot of big things. I earned some money, I gained some muscles, I met some new people, made some new connections, which is very good. I'm a little bit exhausted, but I want just to talk to you from my whole heart. And today we're gonna talk about self-confidence. So this is a really big theme and this is a really important aspect of your life. To be self-confident. It is the most important thing in your life. I'm saying this because your achievements depends on your level of self-confidence. So, for example, if you are not self-confident person and you are something like doesn't believe in himself like doing actions so it is mostly probability that he will fail you know and he will fail in his actions so if person doesn't believe in himself he fails in his actions so if it happens that means his self-confidence gets lower because his actions was failing so the first thing is just believing in yourself believing in yourself that you can make it happen and you can make it good you can make it in the best way possible and you have to believe in it and the person who believes in himself he will be good in his actions he will be productive he will get best results and he will astonish everybody else around him and this is really important to believe in yourself so don't forget that believing in yourself is one of the keys to self-confidence because I am believing in myself I can make every action I take, I can make it work, I can make it, I can make it and achieve good results, you know, because I'm believing in myself and I'm believing that I can make it, you know, so I can make you a really, I can give you really, really just easy and calm example. So you are at stage public speaking, you know, it is known to the fact that uh, around 90% of people are having fear of public speaking and public speaking is one of the biggest fears in this planet, you know, and over to like Deaf and death and like uh, killing somebody uh, or just um, or just uh, being kidnapped is less fearable than just going uh, to speak to the audience. But this is not the point. I can like eliminate your public speaking fear like just by talking to you right now 
and I can make you know. So I'm believing in myself. So one person goes to the stage and he's saying in his mind, he's saying, I'm gonna fail. I'm a loser. I will never make it well. I will make something bad. People will will, will gonna laugh at me. So what happens in this specific situation? Person is going to the stage and what he believes happens in the true true life, in the 3D world, you know? He just fails because he doesn't believe in himself and his words are not coming from his mouth and he's just talking uh, really messy and not to the structure. So he fails. And we have a second situation which person just walks to the stage, he's calm, he's ready, he is ready. He's ready for what? He's ready to win. He's ready to win. He's saying, I'm the best, I can make it. I can make this speech good, you know? People gonna listen to me, people gonna love me, people gonna accept me. People will be commenting how well I spoke in this specific event. So in 3D, what happens? He succeeds. He makes it come true. And by believing in yourself, you can make those actions 10 times better and and your actions will be much more efficient, much more positive, and it will bring you much more positive results if you believe in yourself. So yeah, this is how you can just overcome your uh, public speaking fear, just by talking to yourself in your mind that I will succeed in it, I will succeed, I can make it, I can make it, and never in your life, never ever again, say I will not succeed and I will fail or I am weak or I am not created for great things because God has created uh, us for big things and we can make so much bigger things that we can think of you know look at Elon Musk doing like space rocks landing space SpaceX uh, like spaceships to the planet on the platforms and just incredible so he's doing that because he believes in himself and in his actions that's all I'm asking for you believe in yourself you know so the second aspect I want to talk about is self-love because if you don't love yourself then it it is not possible for you that you will succeed and that you will be self-confident person. So yeah, we all may face traumas in our past life, but the main thing is just understanding that we all can, can just figure it out. We can all heal, we can all learn and adapt positive things to our lives and we can we all can change ourselves you know this is our decision to do so so if you actually love yourself and uh, you will get much better uh, results in your life also so what is self-love? Self-love is just understanding that you are unique individual with unique habits, with unique, unique mindset, with unique body, with unique language, with unique culture, with unique hair, with unique 
arms, with unique legs, with unique neck, with unique belly, with unique chest, with unique lips, with unique nose, with unique eyes, with unique facial structure. So, and also understanding that you are just invaluable, you know? Because you are so, so valuable that you can, that just nobody can measure a value, you know? Nobody, because it is so expensive. So you have to understand and you have value in yourself. Yes, I know you can just be having some traumas in your past life, but I'm saying to you that everybody in this world is equally valuable and that value is invaluable you know it if you put all diamonds in this world and you will sell them just and uh, just for one person this is not true because person is not invaluable it's just invaluable you know so just think about it for yourself if you value yourself um, that much and sometimes you can value too much yourself which is ego so it's really important to overcome ego also and you can do so by just by just understanding that your self-confidence is not your ego and self-confidence is just taking actions and speaking with actions not the words and ego speaks with the words in yourself like i'm the best and uh, other people are worse you know it's putting people down it's unfair self-confidence is i am self-confident and i'm equal as other person and I can achieve so many great things, but other person also can do it. And it just depends on the mindset we have, you know? So I talked about self-love. Firstly, I talked about believing in yourself. Secondly, I talked about love. So, and the third thing I want to talk about in today's video is just understanding it's just understanding that you will not overcome anything without discipline so the third thing is discipline, you know. And discipline, I'm saying, bro, it's the most important things in your life. From my personal experience, I, I just achieved brightest things when I was doing actions with discipline. So... Discipline is just like a system. You get up, you get up every day, you meditate, then you just read a book or something like that. Um, then you just go to the uh, morning breakfast and then you just go to the sport or work, you know, then you meet with friends and sleep. And this is actions you just doing every day. And these actions improves you as an individual. So, well, for example, uh, I'm going to the gym, you know, and for three to, three to four times a week. And uh, actually, it brings me so much greater results when I know what I have to do and I'm doing it instead of just messing around and doing one thing one day second second day you know you have to put everything in order in your life and you have to be disciplined and make your words come true 
into real actions and make your thoughts come true you know if if you are is the discipline is the main thing is just doing what you say you're gonna do you know if you say i'm gonna run today i will run today if i say i'm gonna meet with friend today i will meet with friend if i'm saying i go to gym and run three kilometers yeah i'm gonna run three kilometers and if i'm say i'm gonna do an arm day today yeah let's go i'm doing an arm day today and there's no escape you know discipline is knowing that it's no es no escape because it's knowing that you have one one choice if you go you get something if you don't go you just stay in that your own place you know you have to grow and in order to grow you have to do something that's it that's it's that simple and just doing every day small things you know if you do one one thing which makes you greater one percent in one day and if you do it for a year you get better 365 percent this is the main of atomic habits book which uh, by napoleon hill i believe and you can read it you know but the main aspect just doing some things every day and this is comes to the my last uh, thing uh, aspect I found out on YouTube and it is about Elon Musk which was interviewed and interviewer asked him why are you achieved so much great things in your life and he said like really really great thing which kept in my head for a long long period of time he said, I never ever give up. So I tried it to myself, you know. What if I will never give up on things I'm saying I'm gonna do? So I made it like as an experiment for a year. And in the better year, I reached the biggest financial, physical, and mental achievements. Because I keep words to myself and I didn't give up. That's it. So yeah, it's end for today and I hope it helped you to get something good. Hope you take, took something out of this speech and maybe you implement start implementing these aspects i spoke about if you don't know that you know maybe you learn something new and this is my goal just to help you to be become the best version of yourself and that's it so that's it for me today and hope you have a great weekend and today is jake paul versus mike tyson so Go watch it.